How long have I been walking? I've lost track of the time. Wow, what is this place? I'd better have a look around this abandoned village. Harry's crew might have stayed here. This enormous stone slab. Look, mm, it's something missing here. This enormous stone slab looks like a mechanism to get up to the outcrop. A tiki, like something straight out of an adventure novel. The Everhart Expedition. They set up camp here. So now you believe in magic, old pal? Polynesian man covered in tattoos. I'm not sure if he looks angry or... Looks like some of the crew members didn't get along too well. A forbidden ritual? Fascinating. Let me record it. So, you said you've been on this island before. Yes. Some years ago. I made a rookie mistake. I did it from my fishing route to go to what looked like a better spot. Less than an hour had gone. I went suddenly. My va'a, my canoe overturned. And I got this lovely souvenir from that mistake. Heavens, what gave you that scar? It's not a what, but a who. I don't know. I didn't get a good look at it. But it seemed like a sea creature I never seen. Anyway, I was lucky enough to reach that Whiteson beach. The one where we landed on the island. A man came three days later and got me out of there. He brought me to the port of Papete without speaking a single word. Time passed, and I promised myself that I would go on with my life and forget about this damn island. Why did you agree to return to the island then? I need to know what happened to me, to discover the truth. I don't know if you get me. Absolutely. They were packing a lot of heat when they came to this island, but they took all the guns with them. Very neat. Quite a looker. A fashion model, maybe. <laughs> Looks like this fellow was a real heartbreaker. His real name was Costas? Nice comb. Who worries this much about their appearance in a place like this? I'm not sure what to expect on this island, but I hope I won't regret not having a gun. Blowing an ancient hatch with dynamite sounds like a fool's errand to me. Ooh, looks like someone didn't like you very much, Harry. This fella sounds pretty hot-headed. cuts through that canyon. It doesn't look safe to cross. An amulet with a carved Marquesian cross. 
The symbol represents balance and protection. Look at this little fella. Why is this hammock so far from the rest of the campsite? Someone on the expedition died. He seems confused, as if he was having a hard time writing this down. Farewell message from a friend. I never thought that this expedition would cause anybody's death. Oh, I'm sure Harry never thought so either. If he'd known this was going to happen, he'd never have come here. I hadn't been close to a grave since my mother's burial. Shortly after she died, my lovely Dalmatian spots, as Harry used to call them, appeared. I thought it was nothing at first. Oh, I must have found the luxury huts. Pretty swanky. I've seen Harry keep even restaurant checks for bookkeeping. He would never tear up a piece of valuable information. Got it. It's been ripped out of something else. The parts of the tiki on this column seem movable. You put together quite an expedition, Harry. And all just for little old me. I'm not really sure how this thingamajig works, or what to do with it. My dear old pal, I know you won't ever read this letter, but I'm accustomed to writing you and it comforts me in this strange place. This island is riddled with secrets. So many secrets. But I'm not only talking about mechanisms and contraptions, Nora. I dare say that something on the island clouds one's judgment. Otherwise, I don't have an explanation for Roy's actions. The man was arrogant, impulsive, and a little cocky, but he was no fool. We weren't friends by any means, but he didn't deserve what happened to him. Nobody deserves that. We may have made some progress in finding the cure for your illness, but at what price? I miss you so much, Nora. Harry. He may not say it explicitly, but Harry blames himself for Roy's death. I know him too well. And I miss you too, Harry. A stranded ship. This explains why the campsite is nearly abandoned. Other planes of existence. That's bats. The Harry of a heart I know would never have given up on this. Something must have...
The Harry of a heart I know would never have given up on this. Something must have happened that kept him from solving it. Black ooze. In a telescope? Where did you get this strange device, Harry? I'm not really sure how this thingamajig works, or what to do with it. It's some sort of Polynesian coat of arms. Is that an octopus? It's broken, but I might as well draw what I can see of it in my journal. What a delicate piece of craftsmanship. Something's missing here. They use the emblem as a headstone for Roy's grave. This one resembles a shark. secret compartment. This appears to be the shrine of a Polynesian chieftain. What kind of stone is this? I've never seen any substance quite like it.
Oh my goodness, what happened here? I better not touch it. And given what happened, they shouldn't have either. That black ooze again. alterations like like the ones on my hands heavens he's losing his mind Pipes. This man was splashed with that black liquid. Whoever took this picture must have a really cool head. Those spots look all too familiar. Is this a picture of my hand? Wait a minute. Is this what was in the doctor's blood? Erythrocytes. Hmm. Ugh, I can't stand the smell of medical equipment. Reminds me of my illness. Is this stone structure a hatch of some sort? Well then, I'm going down. Come on, Nora, deep breath. I can press these star-shaped tiles. Is it calling to me? Another eye. Ah, uh, I hear whispering. I hear it. I'd, I'd better draw it just in case. Oh, the whispering, it... it stopped. Was I imagining all that? Yes, I think I solved it. I wonder what I might be able to see with this lens. It fits. What? What on earth? What is happening? My God. What was that that I saw? What were those stars?
Looks like I solved it. Great Scott! Oh, the, the, the well is filling up. That, that's black ooze. No, no, no. no. It's happening. It's happening. I, I'm feeling faint. What is this? Where am I? Am I dreaming again? This is different. It isn't my recurring dream. I can't stop walking. My legs aren't responding. Holy Moses, what... what is that creature on the horizon? Wait a moment, I... no, no, no! Underwater. I have to get back. I, I have to find... What is that? What kind of creature is this? I need to get a closer look. 